frost out there this morning with temperatures last night falling to lows of around zero to minus three. And we have had some beautiful sunshine too. Now, as I speak, we've got this weather system pushing towards us from the southwest, but ahead of it, we've still got some fine and dry weather to come this afternoon. But cloud increasing all the time from the southwest ahead of this area of rain. Top temperatures, well, for some of us into double figures, around 10 or 11 degrees Celsius. And those winds are going to be picking up eventually too. So through this evening and overnight, that thicker cloud and outbreaks of rain and drizzle moving north eastwards. Behind it, drier and clearer skies, and it will be quite blustery for a time with gusts of about 25 to 30 miles an hour. Now underneath those clearer skies in the west, temperatures could eventually fall down to around 2 or 3 degrees Celsius. So we can't rule out a frost for some of us, and we are likely to see some areas of mist and fog overnight too. So tomorrow, the system responsible for the overnight rain steadily pulls away onto the near continent. And I think once any mist and fog has gone, for many of us, it'll be a fine and dry day with some sunshine. But the further east you are tomorrow, the more likely it is you'll hold on to thicker cloud, even into the afternoon with some showers. Temperatures again for many of us tomorrow up to about 10 or 11 degrees Celsius and we're back to light winds. And we keep light winds on Wednesday, hence the fact that the isobars are so far apart. High pressure starting to build in from Scandinavia. So I think with those light winds, any mist, fog and low cloud might be a bit slow to clear on Wednesday, but eventually we should see some brightness and sunshine coming through. Thursday, the chance that a little trough will come in off the North Sea and introduce some thicker cloud and some showers, but it hasn't quite made up its mind what it's going to do yet. But Friday should be dry for all of us. And then we're probably going to see some rain at some point over the weekend. But again, we're not quite sure when it's going to arrive, but there'll be some fine and dry weather too. Susie.